Hello, I'm Alex from Ranheat. And in the week before the materials and finishes show, we're here at Handcraft seeing how they're using our MSU 300. Handcraft are a kitchen manufacturer based in Wellingborough that can produce up to 300 cabinets a day. This can be producing up to 10 tons of wood waste a week. So let's all see how this gets made. Turning these sheets, then cut into the right sections on this saw, with the pieces then going on to be edge banded here, with the holes being put in by a CNC driller and any grooves required. When all of these different machines producing dust, all of this dust is collected in a centralized dust extraction system. It then comes out the bottom of the dust extraction system and is conveyed in the top of the silo. The silo effectively buffers up the wood waste so it can be stored until it needs to be used automatically by the industrial wood waste boiler. The conveying system takes the material coming out of the bottom of the silo and moves it over into the stoker where the speed of the stoker is changing depending on the demands of the heating system and the boiler. That wood is then fed into the fire chamber and then it's burnt and then that energy is released. Those hot combustion gases are then passed through the air water heat exchanger to make hot water. The combustion gases are further cleaned up and all the particulate is removed by our ceramic filter here. The pump takes the hot water produced in the boiler and sends that either into the factory to the heating system or to the dissipator. The dissipator is a big externally mounted fan coil that just releases the heat out to atmosphere. This is to make sure that there is always enough heat demand and load on the boiler so that we can keep up with the disposal requirements of handcraft. This low temperature hot water heating system pipes the hot water around the factory and then uses these space water fed space heaters to push hot air into the factory to keep you lovely and toasty. So thanks to Handcraft for hosting us today. That's all.